Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video I'm filming on my phone again because I only have a couple of hours between now and when I've got to go to work and if I do it on the computer with a camera it's just going to take forever. So I thought I'd just do a little video on some of the products that I've received from Boots as one of their product testers. Now if you already know about my blog and that then you probably would have already seen the blog post that went up about the items and how it works and all that. But I thought I'd just do a video to explain it a little bit better. <clears throat> and then for those of you who can't be bothered to read, you can just listen instead. So basically, Boots, as in like the big brand Boots, they um, have a volunteer panel. And you can sign up to be on this panel and they'll basically send you either products that are in the works or like new products to test out to make sure that, you know, they work properly, they smell good, they get good reviews on it, and then they like bring it out to the shops. So I signed up whew, about a year ago now, and I've only received three things. So it all depends on the like surveys and requirements for each one, because when they have an opportunity and you've signed up, they will send you an email with a survey saying, do you want to take part in this, like this study? And the most recent one I got is hair mousse. So we'll just use hair mousse as an example. So they'll basically say, do you want to try out this hair mousse? You obviously say yes or no. And then you have to go through a range of questions about your hair. If it's skin stuff, you have to go about your skin and like if you've got any allergies, if you're able to test it like right now and if you're testing other things at the same time. <clears throat> and so when you go through all of these questions at the end, it kind of gives you a chance to select like what you want to receive. Sometimes there's more than one. Sometimes you can get like a lipstick, a lip gloss and a body butter to choose from or you can get like the hair mousse a blush and an eyeshadow pan so you can always like I apply for all of mine like I want to test everything so I literally apply for everything that comes my way unfortunately I have not been lucky enough to receive like multiple items at a time to test but they do like offer it in the survey so I guess they do send it out but anyway <clears throat> I'm like dying today honestly I thought I'd just get into the products that I've been sent. So the first product that I was sent is this body butter here and this is expiring in December so I had it for quite a while now and um, yeah there's not really much to say about it. It is literally just a body butter but it does smell really really good and I doubt I'm going to be able to use up like this much by December. So I'm just going to like lather up my arms and hands right now because it, it does feel so good. Leaves your skin feeling amazing. But the only problem is if I run out of this product, there's no names and there's no way for me to identify this like on the shelves because it's just in like plain packaging. And then on the back, this is all it says. So you've got Boots Nottingham, then you've got the product name, so Body Butter, formulation code, batch code, user trial number, which is, you know, my trial number, and then the expiry date. So they don't really give you much information about the product. So when I do run out, about, out of this, I, I don't know, I probably won't be able to repurchase it again, which is a bit of a problem because I want it. Do you know what I mean? The second product that I received is this little clay mask here. So again very limited information, no pack, like no branding on the packaging, it just says clay face mask, used by date, March 2018. So I haven't actually used that much in here and you can see like there's not a lot of product left. As clay masks go, it was quite watery so I was just like, okay. And you know, there's nothing really amazing that stood out to me. I was really, really excited to try out a face mask because if you've been like watching my channel for a while, you'll know that I'm absolutely obsessed with face masks. So as soon as I saw that as an option, I was like, give me it, please. So when I got it, you know, I was over the moon because I was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, I got a face mask. And yeah, it's just like a really, really basic clay mask. But again, same problem with the packaging. If I wanted to repurchase it because, you know, it's probably like one or two uses left. I couldn't because I, unless the product in the store is in this exact container and I went in and I was like, I need a clay mask that looks like this. And they were like, oh yeah, I know what you're on about. Do you know what I mean? I don't think that's how they do it to be perfectly honest. 
but that was the second item that I've received off them and the third one I've yet to test because it literally only came through the door like a couple of weeks I say a couple of weeks like a week and a bit ago and it is <coughs> this hair mousse you know from the example at the beginning so I did actually apply for this hair mousse and I got it I was going to do a video of me like testing out hair mousse but then I realized how boring that would probably be to you guys because obviously I'd have to do it in order to review it for boots and test the product fully and I guess everybody knows how to use hair mousse no one wants to see me use it so again very plain packaging on the back this time though we've got a extremely flammable sticker saying that it's um, dangerous and to not expose it to temperatures no smoking do not spray on an open flame and then the front sticker just says hair mousse, the product number, the reference number. Expiry date is September 2018 and this is like a full size product here. When I originally signed up I thought I was going to be getting sample sizes. This is definitely not a sample size of body butter. This, I don't know if you'd class that as a sample like face mask, maybe like a deluxe sample. But this is definitely like full on giant size product but I haven't even like squared it out yet so I'm not even sure what it smells like so I'll save that for you guys but again if I went into shop maybe I'd be able to identify it with the purple cap but I think we should really be like able to repurchase the items that we have tested like knowing what items we have tested so on the bottom this is like the only interesting thing I don't know what it is here it looks like 002, then I put it that way and it looks like 700 or something, so I've got no idea what that is on the bottom. When you do test all these products, you get one of these little brief sheets, you know, actually from Boots, and it basically says, right, you have to keep these like until you complete the studies. I'm pretty sure I've got the other two somewhere else, but obviously this is the most recent. So on here, it says this product is for Maria Joy, which is me. And I've got to be using the product on Tuesday the 24th of October until Monday the 30th of October. So that's when, that's like the actual testing period, even though I have it now. And um, it said the feedback questionnaire will be emailed to me after the testing period. And it basically says in here that I'm not allowed to pass the product on to anyone else. So only I'm allowed to use this until literally next year. Only I'm allowed to use this hair mousse. Bobby loves hair mousse. Bobby loves doing his hair. But unfortunately, he can't use that. <coughs> it says to check the ingredients to make sure you're not allergic to anything. And then it says, so that we can use your results, please use the product as soon as possible. So even though it said the 24th, it's now, when I'm recording this, like the 20th. So I've still got this like four days early. I could probably test it out way earlier than they want. And I've got to use it at least five times over the next 10 days. So, okay. The only instructions that they give here for like actually using the product, it just says shake can well before use. Point can downwards and dispense a small amount onto your palm, smooth evenly through hair, then style. So, that's pretty much it. On the back, you've just got the risks, questions about questionnaires, you know, their contact info. So, I really just want to, like, squeeze this onto my hand right now. And that's probably where we're leaving the video. So, shake it, point it down, a small amount. What the hell just happened? Right, I'm not even kidding you. Can you see that? That is my wall. I know my wall is gross. But look. <laughs> okay, so I think I got a little bit more than I needed to. And hair mousse definitely doesn't belong on your face. So, first impressions. Jesus Christ. Right, first impressions, it actually smells really good, so I'm kind of not so mad that it's all over the window and the curtain and the, yeah. So this is a lot of hair mousse in my hand right now. I did only use a little bit, but, you know, it kind of spurted into my eye, so I couldn't see. But it smells really fruity, like berries, like a mixed berry sort of 
Well, actually, it smells like Vimto, you know, the drink Vimto. Berries. I'm just gonna have to like pat it into my hand because I'm not actually putting it on my hair. I mean, I could. Just on my little ponytail. But um, <clears throat> yeah guys, I apologise for coughing so much throughout this video. I am getting slightly ill. At the minute in the UK there's like a flu virus thing going around along with another cold, along with like a tummy bug. So I'm kind of like just avoiding people. But um, yeah, I just wanted to come on here to show you guys what I've received from Boots as one of their product testers. And at this moment in time, like right now, <clears throat> you can still sign up to be part of their panel. I think it's UK only, so if you are a member of the United Kingdom, you know, go sign up. I'll leave the description in the link where you can sign up, but as I said, they are open right now, but I don't know if there's like a lot of people signing up. They might close it again to work through what they've got. I'll also leave the blog post in the description as well because I did go into a bit more detail about the products and my reviews on them and hopefully if you like follow me on Instagram at some point you'll probably see me messing around with this again in my hair trying to style it nicely but um yeah it doesn't taste good if you did enjoy today's video then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up I do try and talk to you guys about the products that I get sent to try and like the different services that I have signed up for in order to get these products so, you know, I'm honest with you. I'm like, yeah, man, free stuff. Let's go. So if you wanted to start receiving free cool stuff from Boots, this is exactly the way to do it. You're helping them out as well because obviously they need to test their products and you get to keep them. So there's really like no downside to the situation apart from like actually writing up the reviews and stuff that can take a little bit of time, but... It's all about you, really. But anyway, guys, I'm going to head off because I have to get ready for work and it's, like, now raining. So I'm just like, cheers, planet. But, yeah. Anyway, guys, I'll see you later. Bye.